All right, it's day 28. We're back home in the gym, basement, whatever you want to call it, my, my little workout space. We are no longer in Cuba, no longer doing it on the beach, so, you know, boo. Anyway, um, <clears throat> from my count, this is day 30. However, it's workout number 28. So having researched this a little bit, uh, doing workouts every single day for 30 days, let alone 90 days, is quite the accomplishment. So, you know, we're ending week four, 28 workouts in approximately 30 days, which is pretty awesome. And we're gonna get to that 90 days. Um, there's gonna probably be another hiccup along the way, you know, unforeseeable, but, you know, let's stick with it the best we can. So we're gonna be working the upper body today. Uh, I'm gonna show you the exercises. We're gonna get back into the three circuits, three exercises per circuit, so nine, nine exercises, uh, 20, 20, 20 seconds, minute rest. I'll just give you a quick demonstration, a couple new ones today. Um, so let's get into it. So this is, uh, we're gonna do some push-ups, and you see that I've got the chair, we're gonna involve the chair today. Also a block of wood or something that you can uh, put, put your hands on and uh, rotate across, you'll see it when I explain it. Okay, so push up with the knees in. I've had this one already, but I'm gonna change this one slightly. So we're gonna go down into the push up position, down about halfway, and gonna bring our knee up and touch. Up, down, knee up, touch, down. From here we're going into a chair leg lift so similar to what we've done before with the glutes but we're gonna be elevated a little bit more and try to go with the toes support the chair against the wall if you can butt up tighten the glutes abs and leg lift this one is working my hamstrings holding my body steady the glutes as well okay from there we are now gonna get into just a wide push-up stance so wider than you're comfortable with <clears throat> nice and wide again we're halfway slow let's make these ones slow Work in different parts of the the body and the arms, chest. <clears throat> Push up with a crossover, starting in circuit two. So we're gonna have this one here, a plate, a box, something you can move your hands over, but it's steady as well. So circuit two is a push-up crossover, I call it, with the hand over knee and then a push-up inchworm. We're gonna start elevated, hopefully by the uh, the end of this this program we'll have a little bit more height here we'll be a little bit more flexible with that <clears throat> we're gonna start in a push-up position standard push-up move over on All right, that'll be the end of that board for today. Hand over knees, get those abs working, challenge yourself, opposites. Into the inchworm. You're gonna do two forward, two back on this one. Start, arms up, <clears throat> pivot at the hips. Bend your knees if you have to. Hands to the ground, good hamstring stretch. Walk your hands out. Push up, push up, walk your feet in. Come right up, hands up. And push up. You can walk your hands back this time. This position. Walk our feet back. Good 
that's your last exercise for circuit two. Circuit three, chair again, chair dips. From here, into chair flutter kicks. Oop, make sure you pull that wall, chair off the wall. Don't hit your head. <laughs> And then finish with a sky push up. So again, push up, reach for the sky, <clears throat> alternate sides. Whew, there you have it. Those are your nine workouts, nine exercises for today. That's the end of week four. We're gonna stick with this. We have one third of the way through it, pretty much. And uh, we'll focus on some legs tomorrow. Stay with me. We're gonna get through this 90 days. You're doing a great job. Good job. See you tomorrow. <laughs>